Morning. Morning. Oh, let's not get run over. <coughs> it's eight o'clock in the morning and it's Tuesday the 3rd of August. And tomorrow evening, me and my dad are flying back to the UK for a wedding. We've got a wedding on Thursday, so we fly back tomorrow night. Uh, wedding on Thursday, fly back Friday, so it's a, a flying visit. Hi, Bob. Hi, Bob. So, good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. That's it, I'm done. <laughs> That's the pronto. So, we're here. Yes, we're at the wedding. It's um, going to absolutely throw it down. It's, it's very windy. It's one o'clock. It gave rain for one o'clock, but yeah, then it changed to five o'clock. But it's spitting now. Yeah, so we need to get inside. It should be a nice day. It should be, yes. Oh, look at my hair. I know, That's it's no windy. Good. But the wedding ceremony is over because I'm doing a bit of video for this weekend's vlog. And to keep your scoffing oh. ice cream. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Emily, yes, and this is Emily, look at her, she's gorgeous. Oh, pretty pictures of you, she's going to took them. There's no pictures of the video. Oh, my oh, my God. Hello, baby. So, are you, are you all all right being on YouTube? Oh, my goodness. No, no. <laughs> you're going to be, you're going to be my ice cream. Lovely. <laughs> so, these are the ice creams. Are they nice? Homemade ice creams. Delicious. <laughs> You've got to try one. You're, you're very natural there, Auntie Kag. You've got to try it. And we've got a shot of uh, what is it? Whiskey. It's whiskey. Oh, That's nice. And, and a little, um, a little glass as well. Want some chocolate? So we all got a little shot glass and a miniature bottle of tequila. We've all got one. There's Bill coming. And we've got to drink it down in one. Is it down in one? But we've got no, we've got no salt and no lemon. It's not round without a bit of lemon though. Right, are we all ready? I didn't see you drink yours. Oh my god. Salt explosion. That's nasty. And we've also got a little bag that's got a tea bag in it and some chocolates, which is quite unusual. I've never been to a wedding where you've had a favour of a tequila shop. And a tea bag of chocolates, what do you think? <laughs> Cameron, you're going to be on our vlog this weekend. Am I? Yeah. Well, Matthew is different. He yeah, certainly is. <laughs> so we're at, Hi, we're at the evening reception. We're shattered. We are shattered. Absolutely shattered. I've got a headache, but I've just got a glass of coke and have some paracetamol, so hopefully I'll be all right. Ooh, and we're good in, we're good in, win some money. Yeah, because we've got a race night. Race. We're, on, we're on race one. So go and get your vets put on. The money from the vet, from the race has been to uh, charity, which is amyloidosis research for the Royal Free Fund, which is a, it's a charity that means part of it so it's a big So that's it's minimum a pound a vet, but we're being big spenders and we're getting two pounds better. So let's see if we win. Yeah. Helen and Bob's loading it up at some wedding at some swanky hall back in back in the UK. The kids, Madison and Cheska, because I think Maddie might be working or might have been working, I'm not sure, uh, sent me a message saying, can you do us a favour? Anyway, the favour is they want one of my Bobo burgers or farmyard burger or whatever we call it. Um, I think I've covered this before, but Cheska's actually having one as it should be, not has she'd like it. So basically you've got bread cob, usually a nice bread cob, southern fried chicken strips, yes these are from Iceland, a uh, bit of mustard on it, a bit of cheese, mayo and then also 
<coughs> burger. In this instance, we're using the burgers that we got last week from Murphy Donner, the garlic and parsley burgers, and bacon. They're very nice, but they're very filling. And you can hear me over the telly and the dogs playing. Bacon's cooking, burgers are cooking, uh, bread cobs are prepped, so rocket, mayo, mustard. I forgot my missing margarine. I forgot about the eggs, so we'll be having eggs on it as well. Proper. How's that? Like you can, like you can get that in your mouth. Do you want a knife and fork? No. Do you want a chainsaw? No. Is it hot? No. Cool. Hello. It's Saturday and we're at the outlet. Apparently, we've got, a, apparently we've got a sale on. Yeah, it says up to 80% off, so they've already got a reduction in price because it's an outlet and they've got it up to 80% off too, so I might find a bargain, you never know. So I'm getting some new sketches hopefully because the ones I've got are knackered and they're no good for America. Yeah, because I keep feeling sometimes optimistic about going to America and sometimes pessimistic, but at the moment I feel optimistic again. It changes. Yes. And it's probably hitting 40 degrees, it's I think, today. There's a warning. Mega, mega hot. There's a weather mega warning. Hot. So. And then uh, tonight, we're, I'm just going to do some pasta for tea. Yeah. So, so most of this. Garlic bread. Yeah, most of this weekend's yeah. vlog's probably going to be you guys on a little trip. Yeah. The back. We're not really, we're a mirage, we're still yeah. in England. This is me doing crazy, <laughs> funky editing skills and, you know, joke. Saturday's tears was never a day to miss cause. What the hell's that? Bit of history. Oh. Nostalgia. Not doing much today, you're not doing much this weekend. You're working. I'm working tomorrow. I'm just I'm gonna cook for Monday tomorrow as well. Yeah. And we're just having a bit of pasta for tea. Now we're not hungry though, because we've just had a big massive fat taco bell, but the kids are hungry. But that was like six hours ago. It weren't six hours ago. It were it were about half past two and we're now on about half past seven, so it was five hours ago. You see, you suddenly realised the moment I worked that part off, wasn't I? Yeah, but you were exaggerating a little bit. Um, uh, what are you making tonight, Chef? I'm making turkey spaghetti. So, I don't feel quite full, I still feel, that's, you don't know that from me very often. No, but I feel full. So in my pan, I've got bacon bits and butter. Well, you buy the bacon bits already, I don't know. In my like, lard ones. Can you get them like that in England? I don't, I don't know, know. they're called lard ones. And then it's going to have a couple of onions in it, some turkey, it's the tenderloin of the turkey that I'm putting into it. I always think it's turkey breast, but it's not, is it? No, it's the tenderloin. I'm going to put some, um, Tomato in it, I'm putting some wine into it, some paprika, I make it a little bit spicy, some garlic, hendos of course. You've got some stuff? Yeah, I've got two, I think we've got another two or three. My arms aching, I'm not used to this, I don't know why I'm not used to this, but. Now, a bit of feedback from Pete, last week's vlog, which got released this morning, and then also we've done another video. This afternoon. We've already had a thumbs down on last week's vlog though, by the way. Oh well never mind, you can't please all people all the time. Um, we've done another video which Helen and Bob's done with regards if you're travelling from Spain to the UK and then from the UK to Spain. They did it last week, so it was well, done. We did it, we did it two days ago. So fact, that's the latest uh, we, we requirements. Did, we did the UK to Spain yesterday. Yeah. So that's quite current, shows you what you need to do. In the description of that video, there is details of where they got the test done, where we ordered them from. They're not affiliated links, it's just, that's what we used, Bosch done. Thanks to Tony that told us about Rand, Rand, Randox. Randox, yeah. I've got to say though, filling that Randox for, uh, form in online is horrendous. Yeah. They actually fill in the form. Is it any worse than the UK location? Yes, form? it's as bad as. Oh God. Everything to do with UK seems to be a pain in the backside. And the feedback from last weekend's vlog is correct i am not 60 i'm actually younger than her even though i don't look it and no i'm not gay only on a sunday in I fact we've had quite know. a few comments about hang on we've had quite a few comments of late we love comments we try and answer all of them most of the time on those it tends to be me that's answering but helen will answer them sometimes as well can you see on this way around yeah. 
Hello. You're not doing a very good job as a sommelier, are you? As a what? Sommelier. Uh, I'm doing a brilliant job as a sommelier. Are you? Well, yeah, why should I not be? Because we're parched. Because you what? Parched. Parched. <laughs> <laughs> All that's going in. It's gone in. Gone in. It's gone in. A bit of um, pimiento dulce's... Um, Sweet paprika. Paprika, yeah. That's just simmering away nicely. I'm just going to put some garlic in it. And then that's it really. It's quite an easy one, this one. Yeah, it's not such an elaborate cooking session. No. It's tasty though. Too late, you've missed me. She's rather great. It tastes Go. better. Then use the garlic. But when you use the garlic press, it squeezes all the juice out of it. When you grate it, it Into keeps the... it. No, it just ruins it. Mm. For me, it tastes so much nicer when it's grated. So I always grate it on the parmesan grater of the cheese grater. I've done, I don't care it. because at the end of the day, it's garlic. Oh, is it salt and pepper? It's got salt, pepper and butter in it. Okay. <laughs> Just one message from my favourite boys. Subscribe, like and ring the bell. Ding, 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 ding. Say ding, ding. <laughs>